Maestro, give me a little vamp in the key of E flat and try to follow along. Come on, guys. I need backup singers. He needs us. We're his family. Our first shenanigan is a family. Let's do it. <laughs> there are those who probably say that I have a rare ability. And I don't just mean the way that I yodel with agility. yodel a hee it's a secret no one's known, but that secret now is blown. I'm a talking dog. He's a talking dog. There's no barking, there's no biting. Don't be scared, this is exciting. And I've got a blog. Yes, he's got a blog. It'll get a lot more hits now. Here's where Chloe does the splits now. <laughs> I've got talking pups. Talking pups. Yes, my puppies talk. Get ready. Hi, I'm Gracie. Hi, I'm talking too. So now the world will know as my legend starts to grow. I'm a talking, blogging, singing, dancing. Name Stan, by the way. Dog. Yeah. That was amazing. How do you do that? Years of training with some of the finest vocal coaches in the world. What? No, I'm just kidding. I'm a regular singing dog. <laughs> and there, my friends, is the Shaggy. <laughs> and that's the story of how I became a world-famous celebrity. Becoming a celebrity meant that I'd never have to worry about anyone experimenting on me ever again. And the next year, I was back at the Hollywood Entertainment Awards as a nominee. And the only nominee for Best Talking Dog is Stan in The Bells of Portugal. <laughs> but you see, Isabella, I'm not in love with your sister. I'm in love with you. <laughs> but through it all, the only thing that has really mattered to me is the one thing I've always wanted in life, to be part of a real family. Many among the millions who now read my blog have asked me, what's it like being a talking dog? Well, in a lot of ways, I'm just like you are. Nothing means more to me after a long day than a hug from the people I love. We love you too, Stan. I can't imagine what our lives would be like without you. This is Stan, the talking dog, saying, so long.